I knew you'd be here. I always come here on his birthday. He always liked celebrating it. <laughs> uh, we would uh, throw these uh, extravagant parties. Mm -hmm. He'd get drunk. And no, it's not your fault. It was never your fault. You know that, right? Some people can't be helped. He didn't want to be helped. I just feel like there's something I could have done. Like, I saw him going down this wrong path and I did nothing. He made his choices, okay? And he is the only one that can be blamed for them. You've got to stop living in the past, feeling responsible. I feel responsible, Beth. I mean, I gave him the keys to the car and I saw that he was drunk and I gave him to him anyway. I'm the reason he's dead. No. Don't say that. We were going to get married. <laughs> <laughs> and he told me that he was going to get help. He told me, um... I know. Look, you're going to have to move forward, okay? He would not want you to be like this. He'd want you to be happy. And you'll never be happy if you're still holding on to him. You gotta let him go. I just... I just feel like a part of me is missing. I feel empty. Okay. Then we'll get that part back, okay? Make you feel whole again. But I can tell you one thing, you're not going to do it by standing here. Do you think he would be proud of me? <laughs> the person that I've become? I mean, we were supposed to start a business together. It was his idea. <laughs> yeah, he'd be proud. <laughs> he would be so proud. <laughs> Let's go. Get you something to eat. 